Asia. I'm a student. I am majoring in biotech. I'm actually voting for Donald Trump this election. The Republican Party has a lot of my values and morals um, in there. I've been very fortunate that it has not affected any of my personal relationships. I actually, some of my best friends and my closest relatives are Democrats and they don't and they won't be voting for Trump this election. Um, I think this has more to do with how I was raised, to be respectful of others and their opinions and allow them to believe what they believe because that's their own right. And we definitely think you are on the right track. So thank you. It's an honor to meet you, we sir. Keep it doing and we will. Trump did a great job with injecting our, our military with $2.7 trillion, which it desperately needed, and um, also gave $175 billion to the Veterans Association. Um, in terms of our future, we know historically that China has bought a, our debt, and through this trade war on China, um, the increased sanctions will have the Communist Chinese Party at a, our will, hopefully. Um, so when he wins another four years, hopefully he'll be holding the CCP responsible, not only for their human rights violations and um, government intimidations in, in Hong Kong and all across China. Uh, and put all of that together, and we are seeing, I think, a dangerous acceleration of cases, hospitalizations, and deaths. I think that he did the best with what he knew. I think he uh, implemented the restrictions pretty early on with at least less than 10 confirmed cases in the United States. So I think that he did a good job there. When he did close uh, the travel restrictions and the borders, especially to China, uh, Joe Biden called him xenophobic as long as with his other uh, Democratic primary candidates, they thought he was racist for doing this. Um, and now they obviously criticize him for it not doing it soon enough. I think that he's already starting to. Um, in July of this year, 1.8 million jobs were created. In August, 1.4 million jobs. And in September, 661,000 jobs. The new mortgage applications, property sales, and consumer spending are all um, drastically increasing and they're almost to pre-pandemic uh, numbers. Still have power.